Hey guys, Spartan117GW here, and uh, welcome to another episode of The Armory, where we talk about just one of the guns out of my collection, whether it's new, old, all the above. So what I have here is the PTS Beta AK. Now this AK came out a while ago. I believe it was like 2011. I actually employed this gun at my first time at CQB City. Uh, it was actually the first time I met Milsom Junkie too, which was pretty awesome. Uh, there it's pretty much a semi-only field and actually now they've changed the rules there. So it's actually zero to 400, uh, I mean it's 400 FPS, zero foot engagement inside the building. Pretty cool actually. Uh, but as you can see, this gun is uh, definitely set up. Now I've changed the way I've set up over the years. Uh, as you can see, I have you know nice little textured uh, rail panels here. I put a Griffin armament muzzle brake on the front. Uh, I have a red dot here, and what's cool is that um, because of the way the, the, the cheek and the height overbore and all that stuff, how everything, everything lines up, you really don't need a riser. I pretty much just put the optic on there, and I'm good to go. And as you can see, everything is just in line. But of course, if you do wear a mask, you may or may not need a riser. For me, I really typically don't wear a mask unless it's necessarily required. But even when I do wear uh, like a mesh face protection, it's really not too much trouble when using this gun. But as you can see, it's one of those ambidextrous style AK platforms. This was kind of made popular because Chris Costa was using a variant of this AK during one of his videos or video shoots or something like that. However it ended up happening, it made this gun really, really popular. On the back, I have a CTR stock, or uh, actually it's a Mo stock. CTR actually is a locking thing on there. So Mo stock and uh, dark earth. Uh, one thing that's really cool is that on this side, you can actually see it. I have my little kind of uh, you know go gun gas pedal set up. That way with the vertical grip, um, you can actually see just get that little bit extra torque in there. So as you can see with the thumb brake method, like I, like I said before, you just get that much more extra, you know, extra oomph, extra you know, torque, extra control over the gun when you're uh, when you have it in position. Uh, one thing that's really cool too, I typically use my US Palm mags with this. You know, I used to use my Beta mags with it, but I found these tend to work better. Uh, they actually hold more ammo, and they're just way beefier too. Uh, and they tend to uh, seat and sit a little bit more securely in the gun. So that's typically what I use. One thing that's really cool that's not out yet. U.S. Palm Battle Grip. What this kind of does is because b before the grips that came with this gun were a little, they're a little big. They're kind of like basically like saw grips or AK grips. What this is kind of cool is that it kind of makes it feel a little bit more like an air grip. I'm more of an AR guy to be honest, but I do like an uh, AK platform that's modernized. So what's cool about this is it kind of just fits my hand a little bit better. It kind of gives me something a little bit more familiar. It's not quite like an AR grip but it's pretty close. So it's actually definitely a lot more comfortable than what I'm typically used to when running an AK. This platform though is pretty awesome. It was shooting like I believe about 400 FPS or so when I first got it. it. May have decreased a little bit over time, but overall really solid platform. There's even a video of Jet running around with this gun at SC Viper. So overall, pretty cool modernized AK platform. Uh, it's actually the only AK platform I still have. Uh, you know, who knows? Maybe in the future they'll make an ERG version of this because that would be pretty sick. Uh, but this is the Beta AK and uh, you know, definitely make sure you guys check it out. There's a few still on the market here and there. You know, anyone who wants the true Beta AK because there are a couple clones out there. Uh, they're not too hard to find, but they're definitely out there. So make sure you guys check it out. Thank you guys for watching. This is Spartan117GW and I'll see you guys on the Bye. battlefield. Bye. Bye. Greg! Greg! Shit's fucking awesome! Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's so cool! God damn, it's so fucking oh, operator! How do you like the, uh, the mags? He, uh, what? I just... <laughs> he just got to God damn it, Greg, calm down! Man, two respawns in this game, two respawns. Thank hey, God. Fans will make them dance. Yay. Fans to make them dance. Dance. Fans to make them dance. Dance, dance. dance. Right here, dance. Right, here we go, supply deep standby! Prepare yeah, for contact, Greg. <laughs> Elite Force BBs, that's what's in my mag. Thanks for watching.